In the midst of the harrowing Spanish flu epidemic in 1920, the Lombardo family faced a heart-wrenching ordeal when their beloved daughter, Rosalia Lombardo, fell victim to pneumonia. Despite their efforts to shield her from the rampant sickness sweeping the country, Rosalia, just shy of her second birthday, succumbed to the illness, leaving her parents, particularly her father, devastated by the loss. Before we let you know what is happening, help us out by clicking the like button and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification button so you don't miss our future videos. Mr. Lombardo, consumed by grief, found himself unable to accept the reality of life without his cherished daughter. Desperate to preserve her memory and maintain a connection with her, he embarked on an unconventional and somewhat controversial path. The Preservation of Rosalia's Body the Lombardo's journey to parenthood had been fraught with challenges, with years of longing and prayers preceding Rosalia's arrival. Her sudden departure plunged Mr. Lombardo into despair, feeling as though he had failed to protect his precious daughter from harm's reach. As the family prepared to lay Rosalia to rest, Mr. Lombardo grappled with the unbearable prospect of bidding farewell to his daughter forever. Driven by an overwhelming desire to keep her memory alive, he sought the assistance of Alfredo Salafia, a renowned expert in the preservation of human remains. Initially hesitant due to the nature of Rosalia's illness and her tender age, Dr. Salafia relented upon hearing Mr. Lombardo's impassioned plea. Recognizing the depth of the father's grief, he embarked on a meticulous process to preserve Rosalia's body, employing innovative techniques and a precise mixture of chemical compounds. Through Dr. Salafia's expertise and careful methodology, Rosalia's body was transformed into a remarkably preserved relic of her former self. Capturing her essence in perpetuity, the preservation process immortalized Rosalia's innocence and beauty, providing solace to her grieving family. However, upon Rosalia's return home, Mr. Lombardo's initial shock at her lifelike appearance gave way to acceptance and reverence for the gift of her continued presence. Creating a sacred space within their home, the Lombardos honored Rosalia's memory, allowing her to remain a cherished part of their daily lives. Yet, Rosalia's story transcended the confines of her family home, captivating the curiosity of their community and eventually the world. Discovered years later by a new family, Rosalia's preserved body became a subject of scientific inquiry and a testament to Dr. Salafia's extraordinary craftsmanship. Today, Rosalia resides in a museum, her lifelike form preserved within a glass case where visitors marvel at her beauty and the enigmatic phenomenon of her occasional eyelid movements. While some dismiss these claims as fanciful, others perceive them as a poignant reminder of Rosalia's enduring spirit and her father's unwavering love. In the end, Mr. Lombardo's unconventional decision to preserve his daughter's body stands as a testament to the profound depths of parental love and the enduring legacy of a father's devotion. Through his extraordinary act, Rosalia's memory lives on touching the hearts of those who encounter her story and sparking reflections on the boundless nature of love and loss.